Hello, this is Mike Lively from Northern Kentucky University, and today we'll be talking about Camtasia Full Circle. We're going to do a series of tutorials on how to edit with Camtasia. There's five steps here. We're going to show you how to annotate using a bamboo pad, editing using zoom and pan, producing for the web or YouTube, and uploading it to a website for using Fozilla, and then linking uh, using a URL either in a web page or blackboard. So we're going to show you how to do these five things in this next series of tutorials. And the first thing you need to do is go out and get yourself a bamboo pad. Now luckily the prices are dropping on these pads. And uh, here's the site right here, www.ergodirect.com. Let's go to that site and take a look at the bamboo pad. I'm on the Ergo site right now and we're looking at the bamboo pad. And we can see it's selling now for $69, which is a pretty good price. And if you've worked with Wacom pads before, this one works really well. has great pressure sensitivity if you're using it with a Photoshop, and it does the job when it comes to Camtasia. So you want to go out and purchase that pad so you can annotate in Camtasia. So let's get to it. It's simple uh, USB connect, hook it up to your computer, and it works. And it comes with an install package as well, but I don't use it for any of my devices. It just It's just pretty much a plug-and-play device. So now that I have my uh, Wacom uh, bamboo pad hooked up to my computer, it's time to uh, change some of the settings in Camtasia so I can get that screen draw effect. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit on uh, Make a Recording. And when I hit on that Make a Recording button, I get this uh, Camtasia Recording Studio Panel. I want to go in there and I want to make some changes. So we're going to go to Tools and to Options. And we're going to go to Custom Toolbar. And when I do, I want to bring over the screen draw tool to the toolbars button. So I'll click on that. And over comes the screen draw. And I have the marker tool here as well. Let's bring that too. And so now when I record with Camtasia, I'll have the ability to click on the pencil and actually record or actually draw with the pencil. Okay. And now I have that ability to draw. Let's go ahead and take a look at that real quick. I'm going to click on that to make a recording. I'm going to highlight something to record and uh, hit record. And you can see now I have the pen tool. And when I click on the screen, I can actually now draw with the pen tool. Let me get my uh, bamboo pad out. And I can now actually draw with my bamboo pad. Isn't that very nice? Now, a lot of really cool features with this pen tool. Look down here. There's a little uh, bar down here. And I have the ability to click on that, and I can make an arrow. And I have an undo that will take me back, erase. I can draw a square or a rectangle. And I can come here and change the colors as well. So if I come along here, I can change the tool or the colors. I can, for example, have black, blue, green, all the different uh, primary colors. But as opposed to clicking on them, there are also the letters here. So if I hit a letter from my keyboard, that also changes the color. Let's click on that and we'll draw a blue square. But now let me just hit the... Uh, uh, Y key for yellow, and you can see I, I draw a yellow square. Okay, so I'll come back with my bamboo pad and let's hit undo a few times. And there's a lot of options here. And if I, I don't want this tool, I can come down here and change the tool and actually have a uh, ellipse, for example. 